Barnes. This is a how-to video for the Unis Revolution on priming the ejector pumps and calibrating flow sensors. Under normal circumstances, you should not have to reprime the pumps on the Revolution. The pumps come pre-primed from the factory. The only time that you may need to reprime the pumps is if the reservoirs run dry, the pumps have been replaced, or some other service has been performed on the pumps. Each pump on the Revolution has its own 532nd clear nylon bleeder tube. To bleed the pumps, simply remove the bleeder tube from this lower push-in fitting, allow some fluid to drain, wait until there are no bubbles coming through the bleeder tube, and then plug it back in. Now we are going to show how to calibrate the flow sensors on the Revolution pumps. As you can see, the LED on this flow sensor is constantly on. During normal operation, the LED on the flow sensor will only come on momentarily for each stroke of the pump. To calibrate the flow sensor, start by loosening up the screw that holds the flow sensor in place. Next, you want to move the flow sensor out until the LED light goes out. Next step, is to slowly move the flow sensor back in towards the pump until the LED light comes on. Once you see the LED light come on, move it back just enough so the LED light goes back off and then tighten the screw. Now with the flow sensor properly adjusted, you can see the LED on the flow sensor light up with each stroke of the pump. If you have any questions, please call Unist at 1-800-253-5462 or email us at salessupport at unist.com.